Did any of you get a, 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 a gift when you gave birth? Like, I can hold my hand up here and say safely that I didn't. Um, unless you count some flowers from a petrol station on the way to the hospital. <laughs> no longer married to him. Uh, no, I didn't. You? <laughs> I... I didn't. I think that I'd pushed the child out. I think that was, you know... Yeah, I that mean, was his present. That was, that was, oh, yeah, that was his present. No, I didn't get a present. Um, what, I, what, what I do remember... Oh, no, it doesn't matter. It's another story. Go on, carry on. <laughs> Talk about push presents. I just remembered something that he said. Yeah, well, I didn't actually push. <laughs> oh. So, um, but I, I did get... Um, Gary bought me this um, vintage watch, uh, which I love, and it's engraved on the back, and it says, thank you for having Grace, our youngest, and he's en engraved it with his name and the, and the other two kids, which That's is lovely. lovely. Which is really, really nice. But, um, no, I didn't actually push. I, the, the second, my second daughter was um, by elective... Cesarean. Yeah, I and I, I'm thinking to myself, actually, do we know whether Megan pushed or pulled? <laughs> we don't, no, do we? Because it was, we, that, we it was all a bit much. shrouded yeah, in mystery. Yeah, it was all a bit yeah. last minute, had to go to the Portland, etc. So yeah. who knows whether it was a push so or a very pull? very American, this nonsense. Oh, it's driving me insane. We didn't even know what it, what, what it was, did we? The push I don't, present. Hey, I don't like the name push present. It's mm. just a bit revolting. Um, and also, don't give me a present at the end of it, because I want to pu push your face in. <laughs> um... <laughs> I remember that. But also, um, it's all very Americanised. It's like this whole... We, we just want everything to to end up in a present or a party Starting yeah. nowadays. Starting prom, didn't it, which was just a so school the, disco. So it's the prom, and then we've got push presents, and then now well, we've got the... it's the dead the, hand yeah, of commercialism, the isn't baby it? baby showers. We never had baby, baby showers. showers. Never had and those. now, the gender reveal oh, party. Oh, God's sake. So everyone meets up and it's a... <laughs> I just phoned people things... and went, yeah, I'm having a girl. That was it. I, I don't didn't... think I even mentioned it. I didn't. It. But Do you know what I've just realised? There's a lot of money as well, don't they, that you should be putting towards the, you know, the baby, I would imagine. And also, who cares? <laughs> Who cares? I think really it comes down to that. I mean, just phone me call. and tell me you're having a boy or a girl. I don't, I don't really need to waste a day watching a pink or blue balloon. I'm no. just being cynical. No. I don't know. I just remembered quickly something. It was just, so it's just something sort of relevant that I had a very long labour with Matty, very, very, very long, uh, 42 hours. Thank you. And uh, <laughs> and when eventually I pushed him out, it was at this very trendy hospital in North London, and they said, um, "Would you like to keep the placenta?" Some people do, and Tim said, no, we'll just take the band sucks. <laughs> <laughs> but don't you think no, it's like... No, I'd, I'd have kept the percent. <laughs> to be fair. Yeah. To so be they fair. talk now about... They, they talk about that we now live in what they call an attention economy. Yeah. So, um, you know, like a couple of people in Love Island, we've never heard of them before they went into Love Island, but they are influencers. Yes. They, go, they quite proudly go, my job is I am an influencer, influencer. on social media. Yeah. So it's all about your followers and how many people look... Mm. at your life. Mm. So a lot of this feeds into that narrative of how, you know, I must have a party because then I can put it on Instagram yeah. and build and up my followers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. I've just realised... Well, I've not realised. I, I did realise it at the time. I've just remembered. Kylie, Can't Get You Out of My Head, was being played at the exact moment that Finley was born. So every time it comes on the radio or whatever, I go, oh, this song was playing when you were born and you got stuck. So actually, I couldn't, couldn't get, get your, your head, head out of me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He hates it. He hates it when I tell that story. <laughs> that Especially was for you, Finn. on live television. Yeah. yeah, that Fantastic. was for him. That was for him. Still makes me laugh, isn't it? <laughs>